Fires continue to rage along the West Coast, including Oregon, where crews are hoping a change in conditions will help them with containment efforts. Our Jamie Chambers is on assignment in Oregon and shows us the destruction the fires have caused. We're currently inside the fire line in the Merriam County area, about an hour south of Portland. There are checkpoints set up by National Guardsmen, keeping people out of the danger area. Four people have already been confirmed killed. Ten more are still missing, with that number expected to rise. The destruction of Bahama City is hard to comprehend. Many escaped the Beachy Creek fire with just the clothes on their backs, with a wall of fire chasing them down the road. And the embers were coming down on me and my car, I'm, on my property, it was starting spot fires. I lost everything, my trailer, my pictures from my childhood, videos, you know, memories from my dad and all this and that. I lost everything. Now the National Guard has taken over the checkpoints into sections of Marion County as the fire continues to burn. Even in areas that are completely burned through, some smoldering embers creep back, then are extinguished by firefighters scouting for flare-ups. It was just a big wall of flame. Ron Pettish says he's trying to get back to his burned out home, but the military checkpoints are shutting him down. I have 12 cats. I got, I got, I saved eight of them, and there's still four still up there. So hopefully they're okay. Some buildings were untouched, others complete losses. This twisted metal was once Jean's Meat Market, a specialty store that has been a staple in the city of Mahama for decades. Longtime residents are still trying to make sense of their community in ashes. I think Mother Nature is very mad at humans for what's for what's happening. We as as humans, we better start doing something about it real soon. The flames have died down for now. The weather is cooperating, but there are still 187,000 acres burned here at the Beachy Creek fire, and they are at zero percent containment tonight. From Marion County in Oregon, Jamie Chambers, Fox 5 News.